Welcome to Creative World viewers today i will solve exercise problem number 32 in this scenario power basic formula voltage multiplied by current will be used and we also will be using passive sign convention theory according to this theory the element with negative power will be considered as power supplier and the element with positive power will be considered as power absorber first read the scenario find the power that is absorbed or supplied by the network elements in figure 1.32 figure 1.32 contains two circuit and we have to calculate each element power in both circuits so without wasting time let's proceed towards solution figure 1.32a the circuit is redrawn here direction of current in this circuit is indicated with blue arrows current through this circuit is mentioned 2 ampere and the voltage across each element is also given except current dependent voltage source its voltage will be calculated using the value of ix voltage source power can be calculated voltage across this voltage source and current through this voltage source current through this circuit is passing 2 ampere and in case of voltage source the current is entering from negative terminal and leaving from positive terminal so this current will be taken with minus sign uh, the power of voltage source will be minus 24 watt and this power is being supplied through voltage source because of this minus sign Similarly element 1 power will be voltage across it 8 volt and current through it 2 ampere in this case current is entering from positive terminal and leaving from negative terminal so this current will be taken with positive sign so the element 1 power will be 16 watt and this power is being absorbed by element 1 before the calculation of power of this current dependent voltage source first we have to calculate the voltage across this source which are 2 multiplied by ix and ix is also 2 so the voltage across this source will be 4 volt now we have voltage across this source and current through it we can calculate its power current dependent voltage source power will be 4 voltage across it and the current 2 ampere which is passing through it In this case the current is entering from positive terminal and leaving from negative terminal so this current will be taken with positive sign so the power of current dependent voltage source will be 8 watt voltage source is supplying power because its power is negative element 1 and current dependent voltage source are absorbing power now the calculations of this circuit can be verified with the help of telegen's theorem according to telegen's theorem the summation of all powers in a circuit is always zero and if we add these three powers their result will be zero moving towards 1.32 figure b circuit is redrawn here the direction of current through this circuit is mentioned with blue arrows we will start power calculations from this voltage source voltage source power will be voltage across this element 24 and current through this element which is 2 ampere but this current is entering from minus terminal and leaving from positive terminal so this current will be taken with minus sign and the power of voltage source is minus 48 watt this minus is indicating that 48 watt is being supplied through this voltage source element 1 power will be voltage across it 20 volt and current through it 2 ampere in this case current is entering from positive terminal and leaving from negative terminal so this current will be taken with positive sign and the power of element 1 will be 40 watt which is being absorbed power of element 2 will be voltage across it 12 volt and current through it 2 ampere 
and in this case current is entering from positive terminal and leaving from negative terminal so this current will be taken with positive sign and element 2 is absorbing 24 watt now before calculation of power of this current dependent voltage source first we have to calculate voltage across it and its voltage equation is 4 multiplied by ix value of ix is 2 ampere so the voltage across this element will be 4 multiplied by 2 equal to 8 volt now we have voltage across it and current through it we can calculate the power of this element current dependent voltage source power will be voltage across it 8 volt and current through it minus 2 here the current is entering from negative terminal and leaving from positive terminal so this current will be taken with minus sign and this element will be supplying power 16 watt because of this minus sign current dependent voltage source is supplying power and voltage source is also supplying power these two sources are supplying power and element 1 and element 2 are absorbing power now these calculation could be justified with the help of intelligence theorem summation of these four powers will result zero which justifies the calculation validity so this was the problem number 32 see you in next video thank you